next new feature is the ability in PowerShell 2011 to create electrodes using the electrode wizard um, when there is no active solid. Now in a case where there's no active solid, PowerShell 2011 assumes that you're going to create an electrode from surfaces and it modifies the front page of the wizard accordingly. So the data I'm starting with here is a surface model. And if I just zoom into the surface model, you can see that we've got a few problems here. We've got gaps. In this area here, we've got overlaps. Okay, so to convert this to a valid solid model would take a bit of work. If we wish to extract an electrode from these two angular regions here, um, in PowerShell 2011, we can do so without um, spending the time to convert this into a valid solid. Now, I'm going to select all of the red surfaces using the selection filter. Okay, so the red surfaces surround.